Hey, it's Smooth JK here. Um, not necessarily doing a tutorial this time. Just wanted to kind of do some gameplay footage and um, you know use some uh, Esper training materials and actually do some friend summons. So um, yeah, why don't I just get started? Just gonna do my Coliseum run. I'm using Edgar instead of um, Sirius right now because I don't necessarily need a bunch of mitigation and all that stuff for these enemies. Once I run into a really tough boss, then I'll go ahead and bring her back in, but Edgar just kind of helps me clear things more quickly and easily right now. Right, so I don't remember if Gravigo works on these guys. Yep, still does. Let's see how much Edgar does. He doesn't have the best weapon right now, but, um, alright, that's cool. Fillion's turn. And Barsa's turn. Yeah, I need to get Edgar a better weapon. It's just a waste of time. <clears throat> Alright, let's see what this boss is. It's a big shark. Alright, so Gravigo's probably not gonna work. Hopefully Thundaga will hit a weakness or something. Not sure. Get a bash. Oops. Actually, I'm gonna use, try to poison him in case he has a lot of HP. Alright, he's poisoned. actually dishing out a lot of damage. Luckily so am I. Golden shield, nice. Isn't that one of the items that you would get in that expensive bundle? Let's see here. Yep, golden shield. Wow, that makes this really not worth it if you can actually get these items and they're not completely unique. So yeah, guys, don't get crystal chest. Plus 38, nice. Mm, 178 defense, 124. Yeah, but Furion's always a permanent member. Edgar's not necessarily, so... Let's give him the Mithril Buckler. Oh yeah, Mithril Buckler is also the other bundle. This guy. <laughs> yeah. I don't know if I realized that before. Anyway, let's go ahead and enhance some of our espers, because I've been doing that um, crystal event pretty frequently, and I haven't used anything yet. Or I've used some stuff, but... Show me the greens. Here we go. Or blue. Okay. She's starting out at level 18. Curious how far I can take her. Anything else? Oops. All right. So 18 to 23, not bad. Um, not sure if I used my reds yet. Nope, I still have some. 19. I think 
that's it, yeah. Shiva. I know this isn't ter terribly exciting or anything, but hey, it's kind of nice to finally use these. Not that there was any reason to save them, really, but I thought I'd have some kind of epic leveling session, but, you know, I'm just getting a few levels on these guys. And then... Why don't we go ahead and use some of our friends' points finally. Just a note, normally standard summons are pretty useless. I mean, people will say stuff about how, um, you know, you can get a whole bunch of dupes and have nice trust masteries. I've saved some of these free units, the ones that seem like they might have a half-decent skill. Um, you can judge for yourself. I mean, here we have camouflage. I don't know what that does. This one, deep protect, that's okay. Uh, I already have it in my party. But, um, Sirius has that, but, well, obviously she would, she's a green mage, but, um, you know, maybe that'll come in useful, that's some kind of heal, Fira's not that useful, uh, no, he's not a free unit, I think the best ones out of the free units are these kinds of, you know, something killer, because you can equip these things situationally, and, um, depending on what kind of boss you're going up against or what kind of enemy. Um, see, like Aquan Killer. Um, yeah, those kinds of things I think are probably the most useful free unit uh, trust masteries to go after. The other stuff is basically skills that you'll already have on your characters um, or you'll have better ones, so it's not necessarily a big deal. It's your call. But anyway, I'm going to say I save it for this kind of stuff this happens maybe every couple weeks or whatever but um yeah like the metal cactuars and the, the little snappers that you sell um that's always handy so this is where i like to use mine hopefully i'll get some blue crystals in these bundles here all right no blue crystals wow that's a lot of free units and very little cactuars very few. Give me some blues. No? Ronaldo? Is this a new guy? Yep. Spellblade. Oh, that's kind of useful. Drainblade. Okay. That could go on Bart's or something. So that kind of proves me wrong. I guess some of these free units do have useful things, but... Uh, units. <clears throat> I'm going to enhance as much as possible. My goal with this trash party that I have here... Um, they're not all trash. I mean, Shantoto is actually pretty good. She has a, a lot of Aga spells. But the, none of these are my main characters, obviously. So I'm just trying to max them out and so I never have to use them again. Um, and the reason I even bother to max them out is, first of all, OCD, and then second, there's a small chance that, you know, someday in Japan, they'll get their next level uh, of evolution, and they might actually turn into useful characters. Um, so, you know, just kind of getting ready for that possibility, but really it's not anything that you need to worry about. Alright, so I need about 3,000 experience here to get this guy up. All right, that should be enough. Almost exactly. All right, now I never have to use Shadow again. Now he can get out of my party. Uh, all right, let me continue summoning here. It seems like they went for more of a mix of the Cactuars and Snappers with the free units. When I did this um, a few weeks ago, it was almost exclusively Cactuars and Snappers. And you see here, I got a really, I got a big one. Was this a Gigantor or whatever? Yeah, this is the best one that you can get. 
So I'm happy about that. Yeah, it seems like they're definitely mixing them in better. Ugh, gotta keep doing this. I know, exciting stuff, right? Anyway, you guys get the point. I'll just do this off camera, but um, I'll see you guys later.